You know, I had been in Mallorca before Hamburg. Mm -hmm. um, Dan's Love really good life. friend, Paul Newsom, happened to be there. Mm -hmm. And Paul took the time to like do a session in the pool with me. And we realized that I had been kicking way too much during the swim. Mm. And so when I would start the bike leg in my previous races that season, I was totally gassed, like I had no power. And, and so we sorted that out a bit. And when I got to Hamburg, I finally felt good when I got on the bike. Yeah. I was seeing these splits and just, you know, you know, when you're seeing positive feedback on your bike computer and um, on the course, it just makes you like more and more motivated. In this pool a couple of years ago, I was working with Lucy Charles. She can kick like this, but she kicks like this when she's when she's racing yeah um she's got a stroke which could look a lot longer and smoother like yours does over here but she doesn't swim like that she swims like this because it's the optimal way for her to swim but with that instruction to slow the stroke rate down a little bit you by and large lengthened out the stroke and brought some of this leg kick in and i think that might tally up with why you're feeling maybe in the first five or six k's on the bike yeah while we're maybe just sort of like a bit cooked at that point it really is incredible. And you, you did mention Paul Newsom. Big shout out to Paul. He um, he does get swimming, especially when it's specific to triathlon and open water. Looking through your performances and your results before this show, it's incredible to see your swim times suddenly accelerate from Mallorca onwards. Yeah.